Welcome to Angie's Creative Studio. I'm Angie. Today I am going to do a review on the uh, Craft Squares Clear Stamp Sets from Dollar Tree. Can y'all believe these sets is a dollar? Um, I have used them. I got them a couple days ago. I thought I made a, I did a, do a video, but I forgot to turn on the silly mic. So, but here's the uh, card base that I did do. They stamp good for a book. But we'll try and see what y'all think. Um, and I've just kind of mixed them up. And I'm using Mento uh, tux, uh, Tuxedia. Tuxedia. Blah, blah. Black, and I'm not talking good tonight. And let me find my stamp block. Hopefully, I got enough battery to last. If not, I'm just screwed. But yeah, my black, my stick. Mento is not looking good. And it ain't the stamp, guys. It's my stamping. So, the, I mean, yeah, it does good if you got, if you know what you're doing. I don't guess I know what I'm doing tonight because I'm having all kinds of issues. No mic sound or no, no sound you know how that goes let's see if I can do this in your bedroom oh no well where's my sheets let's try to stay zone see if that wants any bedroom oh yeah well my stay zone is about out of ink too I just re-inked my Mento, but yeah. Why don't we use this little party and uh, let's call him uh, Blue. Let me make sure this got some ink in it. And I'm just going to use my uh, alcohol markers real quick. And I want to say a, do a big shout out to all of my new subscribers that I've been getting in the last few days. Thank you from the bottom of my heart, guys. And y'all, I am really trying to post every other day. I'm not making no promises. Because I never know how my health, my health is going to do. And for the ones that don't know, I do have a health issue um, with my heart and all that fun stuff. But... I'm just going in with the, the colorless blend and just kind of making it more light on in places. Um, it's just what it is. Um, I hate it. But it's what God gave me and I'm dealing with it. I just hate that a lot of days I don't even feel like ca I come out here to the craft room, but I sit and look at all my stuff like, I want to do something, but I don't feel like it. And, and I know some of it's probably depression also, and this pandemic is not helping nobody. 
including me. So y'all, if y'all have loved ones that deals with depression and y'all know it, be there for them. Even if it's just to chit chat with them or just do a video chat with them, you know, you never know what just a little or a pickup card say hello you know hi you know you just never know and you know i know a lot of states has been on lockdown thankfully i mean i'm i'm glad arkansas hasn't been but it could have been us you know and i know that i mean i really truthfully do know that and I'm going to use this brown on the, his beak. I know most brains don't have that brown beak. But that's what I've got handy. And then I'm going to do some fussy cutting. Who likes to fussy cut? Now I do have the uh, brother skin to cut. And I could skin this in and cut it. But I'm just being lazy. Sometimes it's just quicker to do it yourself and not mess with the skin and cut. Well, I think. I mean, it might cut like you want it and it might not. You never know. I ain't got good at it yet. So, how's everybody's weather doing? I know we're supposed to be getting cold, cold stuff. I'm not ready for it. I like the warmer stuff. Yesterday was like 60 degrees here. And I loved every minute of it, guys. I mean, I promise you, I loved every minute of it. I am bringing in a cutting mat. I want. And then I'm I'm looking for a craft knife. Now I've got three or four of them, but I've got to you. And I can't even blame it on my husband this time. Well, is that the one I'm wanting, but I maybe it won't. I'm just cutting this out between his legs. Well, I'm trying to. Let me rephrase that. I think I did. Okay. There he is. Now I'm going to move this mat because I don't want ink all over it. Mostly stays on or mento. And I'm going to use and now I'm going to open up the other package. going to put this on the uh, block. I'm going to get a five and a half by four inches because I do note cards more than I do any size card size I that I can do. I mean I can do big ones but I just I don't know I think the note size is the easiest and I'm going to take this rose and I'm just going to make my own border around the whole card that makes sense and I'm going to stamp like off of the side and I'm not going to do no perfect order or nothing I'm just I'm just playing 
I mean, that's face facts. Who don't like to play in inks? <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I am trying to clean my stamp set. Okay, let's do let's do a butterfly. And if you don't know, I love I love my butterflies. If I can do this better, I mess up. I'll have to redo it, guys. Ah! Mm -hmm. Not the best redo, but I think it won't. I don't think nobody will know this except maybe me. Let's, uh, the saying I want to put on it is, have a nice day. And I'm, I, I'm just interchanging the two step sets that I've got from Dollar Tree. To make this corn. Um, there's no certain way of making one. I mean... Use your imagination. I mean, you can follow mine, or you can do, you know, what you want to do. Um, I'm going to put this little B. Let's see. And then we're going to put another one. And he's flying upside down. <laughs> and then, um, what's the little ladybug? And then I'm, I think I'm going to put a ladybug on here. And we still got to put him on here somewhere. We may stick him. We'll see. We may not even use him after I cut him. Fussy cut him. Because I forgot about him. And I'm going to take alcohol markers again. And I'm going to see this. Oh, it's still dry. Okay. I'm just going to go in and call all these roses. And I'm just going in with different corners of my alcohol markers. Um, you can use what, what you got. I know a lot of people don't have alcohol markers. I love my alcohol markers. If you got Sharpies, use them. Um, use what you got. I mean, that's my motto. Y'all know that. Um, 
might go get a few more. What's this eight? Is, is it exactly all the ones I want? I don't think. And y'all, I do get quiet when I'm coloring. And I'm sorry. I get my mind on one thing and that's all it's on. Um, and I, I use a contact paper to, to work on. Mostly if I'm doing videos because I don't stop to think what's underneath my um deal um and then I use a glass mat and with the glass mat I never I just use what I've got I just start cutting or whatever <sighs> so just so y'all know I'm I don't try to mess up stuff too bad but the one thing I like about the freezer paper is that I can when I get done with the video I can throw it away and don't have to worry about all the messes and all the and my dog is fixing to go off okay Let's call a little, little bee yellow. And they ain't exactly yellow, yellow. And I'm gonna call this one right here yellow. Or this rose. And I think I'm going to use this one as the yellow too. Okay, I'm going to color the ladybug red and then I'm going to color a couple of these roses red and like I said I'm not doing this in no uniform way I'm just I'm just having fun Let's color this one red too. Okay, now I'm going in with the blue. I say I. <laughs>
Yes, Miss Tootsie. What you doing, baby girl? For the ones that don't don't know, we we raise Maltese puppy or oh, Maltese dogs. Um, Tootsies are female. They are house dog. They are house dogs, but they are um brutal are brutals um and they rotten let me tell you anyways uh tootsie's uh preg hopefully pregnant she's just going out of heat and um she thinks she's the boss <laughs> what dog don't huh but jesse thinks he's He's getting to be just about as bossy as she is with you. They both want your attention at all times. I'm going in with the pink and just going to do a few of the roses and pink. Do this one pink. And like I said, you can use uh, colored pencils, crayons, uh, what you got. I mean, um, just make sure you use uh, stays on or mento ink with the uh, watercolor markers or the alcohol markers uh, because otherwise everything will smear if you don't know that just try to save y'all some headaches <laughs> and even with the alcohol markers I think at times the like the lighter corners they do it still smear some had to see if that won't work, but it don't. Not even by a long shot. Okay, now I'm just going to go in and cut color the butterfly with the same colors I've used with the roses. <coughs> Hush, Tootsie. And yes, I can tell which dog's barking most of the time. And she hears another dog outside honking, so. And we have a, we've got a big dog that's outside. She used to, when me and my husband, Joey, got married, uh, she didn't like, I mean, she did have a whole lot to do with me. And I'd be sitting out here in the craft room at night by myself. And uh, was eating Oreo cookies like I really needed them. And uh, anyways, I started get feeding on Oreo cookies. Now she thinks she 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 thinks if all the time she needs Oreo cookies. And Joey's like. Uh, 
You gonna make her fat while well, she's got pudgy. Not counting what the Oreo cookies did to me. <laughs> but it's okay. It's just life, you know? And I'm just going to fill in the rest of it with yellow. Miss Tootsie, what's he doing? You are for filthy to die. Okay. Now with that being done, that's all I'm doing with it, I think. Except I'm going to put a little border around it. And I'm going to use the Stays On Ink ink pad. And I'm just going in just roughing the edges. Just for kind of makes it look like it might be finished. to fill in this and I'm just gonna go in and kind of dot it mm. and I don't think it was the ink the stamp I think it was more of the function that was stamping it I really do okay now um, I've already got uh, my card base pre-cut. I just used Nina White that I buy at Walmart. And I'm going to fold it. I am cut it eight, 8 inches by 5 and a half. Oh, yeah. Something like that. And... Glue would be good here. Where is my glue? I had it. I had an explosion last time. I know I ain't done nothing with it off my desk. Ah, we found it. And I'm using art glitter glue. Um, I just like my art glitter glue. It takes just a little bit of it and you can have it all done in no time with it. And it may explode again. I don't know. I'm gonna find my um uh, week week of yellow brush. Maybe I got some stuff in it. May not. Yeah. And I think I'm just gonna go in and hit a few of these flowers with this. Just kind of give it a shine. I'm not going to hit every one of them, I don't think. I'm just going to hit a few. I think this one needs to be I think I need a new one. I don't know. 
been a while since I've used one. Then I'm just gonna go put a little bit on these wings of the baby. Let's do just a few of these. Okay, I'm done. Okay. Well, let's put this. I know what we'll do with him. We'll just stick him right here. What y'all think? Well, I take his tail out. Okay. Nobody will know except us. Okay. I had fun doing this. Thank y'all for watching. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to us. Um, and I do give the um, thumbs up on the Dollar Tree stamps. Um, as you can see, I mean, yeah, I don't know if it's me or the stamps. But I think it's more me than the stamps. Because I'm so out of practice. Um, y'all have a blessed day. I'll catch y'all later. And thank you all that has subscribed and is subscribing. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate every one of you. Thank you. Have a blessed day. I'll catch you later. Bye.